Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to explain part 118 of Java for tester series. That is caret method of string buffer class. Caret. Caret method is one of the predefined methods of string buffer class in Java. String buffer class in Java has different predefined methods and this caret method is one of them. If you remember, even the string class, the string class in Java has also has this caret method, guys. In this video session, I'm going to explain about the caret method, which is one of the predefined methods of the string buffer class, okay? This caret method belongs to string buffer class. Whatever the session I'm taking, I'm going to take the caret method, which belongs to string buffer class, guys, okay? Fine. So what is the purpose case? So what is the purpose of this caret method? The purpose of this caret method is to return. Okay. Return the character literal in the given string literal text using the index value. So what does this mean? Let me explain. Okay. It returns the character literal in the given string literal text using the index value. What does that mean? For example, guys, there is a string literal text like this. Okay. And using this caret method, if I use caret method like this, char it, and if I give the index value as five, okay. Okay, if I give the index value, index value as five. So what this caret method will do is it will go to the string literal text and retrieve the character literal at this particular index value in the string literal text that is 0th index 1 2 3 4 5 at 5 guys we have this character literal known as m so that m will be retrieved from this string literal text by this caret uh, method and then okay that's the thing guys okay it will return you capital m okay from the string literal text at the index 5 we have this capital m guys that will be retrieved by this that will be retrieved or returned by this caret method. So let me practically demonstrate this for you. String buffer a is equal to new string buffer. Then I have to give the character uh, literal here. Let's say I uh, have to give the string literal here. That is Arun Motori. Okay, like this string literal text. So this is done. Now if I have to say system dot out dot print ln a dot char it a dot char it and i will give the index value as five guys okay this char at five in the string literal text that is stored into this variable a this is a string literal text arun motor which got stored into the variable a i am going to this caret method is going to return the character literal at this index five so zero one two three four and five is space guys right? after space we have five okay 0, 1, 2, 3, 4th index is space and 5th index is m. So 5th index is m, guys. This m will be returned by this char at method. Okay. Once this uh, single character letter that is m is returned by this caret method, this println statement will be print, printing that into the output. Let's run this and see whether we got the output or not. You see, we got the m. So whatever the index you pass, guys, based on the index value, the Related character will be retrieved from the string literal text. Okay. Here index at index 5, we have the character m. So caret has retrieved this character m from the string literal text and then print ln statement has printed it into the output like this. So this is how guys we have to use a caret method of string buffer class in Java. In the next video session, I'll explain how to use delete method of string buffer class. So that's it, guys. See you in the next video session. Thank you. Bye.